put some um, some ratchet tie downs, some retractable ratchet tie downs. Actually, I put some boat tie downs on my trailer for my side by side. Right there. But right there, I took an eighth, uh, an eighth inch drill bit, put a pilot hole in there. I took that step drill and measured how the hole, I measured the hole on there. I put this actually on the bottom of that to see where it fit. And I did that right there. So that right there would cover. It could actually, it would have actually went a little bit farther, but that hole is actually big enough. When it got to there, I stopped it. So it'll, it'll fit over that, but it doesn't have to be, you know, stupid big. So anyway, you don't want to go any farther than that. But you put some tape on your step bit so that you don't go past the, the area and I could, like I said, I could have went down to there, but I didn't. I go, I went to right there, but I'm not even cutting all the way to right here. So anyway, pilot hole, eighth inch bit, step bit, drill. This drill here is a, this is actually a driver. Uh, but it's just, you see the driver is, it's just a Hercules, Harbor Freight, nothing special. And then that's the uh, coolness, Ryobi. Uh, the only thing is, you know, and I'm using these drill bits right here, You'll spend all day trying to drill with one of them big ones trying to get through and never do that. I learned the hard way. But the, the cool thing about these is this. Check this out. Because everybody knows this is what you use. You tan them down with all that. Man, it takes forever. I hate it. I saw somebody do this. Pop that loose. I got that hooked on it. That's a little small bar down there. Not so to, to the frame, but to a... To a actually, I'm looking at the right there. I'm hooking it on that bar right there. And all it is is just to keep it side by side from rolling back. This is not gonna stop it from flipping over and even those straps back there. You turn your truck over, this thing's coming off this, this trailer. I don't care. I don't care what strap you got on. You turn that trailer, you turn that trailer over, something's breaking. So same thing over here, and all you want, well, all you want, real cool, come here, take it, put it right there, pull up on again. That right there, when you cock, when you, when you watch this. Here we go. Click, click. That's right there. That's tight. I might even get another one in there. I'll cut. And then we'll have no walking around. All that big crap, all that stuff. Man, these are cool and everything. And maybe if I was, you know, in, in, a, in a pinch or two until I see something slick, those will work. But I'm telling you right here, just to cast me out. I'm gonna put the other one in and I'll show you the rest of the video. And that's a 19, there's another one. That nut's a 19. And that and that and the and the head of that bolt is five eighths. So you need a 19 and a five eighths. Or a three quarters of a five eighths. And then you don't need to lose the um, the the nut. I don't know there yet. All right, and then I also, even though it's got a lot washer on it, it's got a lot washer, man, I'm using some of that red. I'm using some of that because I don't want to back it out. So let me get to finish the little bit. She on there, man. She on there tight and slow. Both on. That is a quick, awesome fix. Quick little tidbit for any trailer, anything you can on trailer. I'm telling you right now. I'm hauling. That's a Pioneer 700. Ratchet him up. Love it.